Hi friends, in this video I am going to the function definition, function declaration and rules for function definition and function declaration. Function definition. A function definition is a statement that tells the compiler to allocate memory for the variable functions and to store it in that memory. For example, I will define a function with name greet. It will take input argument of name. In function body, I will declare greet with variable. And it is initialized with the string hello. In the next line, I am going to print this hello message. In main of function, I am calling this greet function with an input argument john. Now I am going to the debug section and placing breakpoint in main function and greet function definition. Now I am starting the debug. Now execution stopped before calling this greet function. And now I am going into this greet function. And in left side variable section you can see all the variable and its value. As well as its memory addresses. So it is clear that in function definitions memory gets allocated and all the value gets initialized. Function declaration. A statement that tells the compiler that this function or variable or class looks like this and is defined somewhere. In this program, there is two functions. One is greet and another one is main function. Now I will move this greet function below the main function. Now I am going to compile this program. In problem section, you can see here there is a warning message that implicit de declaration of function greet. This is because of compiling start from top to bottom. And here we called this greet function before that uh, greet definition. To solve this problem, we have to declare this greet function before the function call. So I will copy the first line of this uh, greet definition and pasting below this uh, library declaration and put semicolon after this declaration. Now I am compiling this program and here you can see in problem section there is no warning message. Just note here we can also solve this problem without declaring the function. That is in the first step I will remove this function declaration from the top. And now I am moving the function definitions of the grid to the top of the main method. Now I am compiling this program and check here there is no warning message. Rules for function definition and function declaration. You cannot define anything more than once but you can declare it more than once. For example I will create another file and name it as program2.c adding library files and uh, grid method to this uh, program2.c file. I am going back to the function.c and here I am including this uh, program2.c using hash include. Now I am running this program. Here in problem section there is a redefinition of the greet method. This is because of you can't define functions more than once. But you can declare the function more than once. For example, I will show here. Now look here. In program2.c, there is one declaration of greet function. In function.c file, there is again redeclaration of the same type. So there is a multiple declaration of the greet function. But the definition of the greet function is contained in program2.c file. Now I am running this program. And here in a problem section, you can see there is a no error or warning. So it is clear that we can't define function more than once but we can declare the function more than once. Thanks for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you.